Something that does very well on social media is conversation starters. So today I'm going to show you how you can create 30 of them in less than five minutes and I'm going to share with you a little secret that will help those posts do better than any other posts. So let's get started. Wonderful. So the first step is we are going to start with the very famous chat GPT. So we are going to ask chat GPT to type 30 conversation starters for social media. Perfect. Once G chat GPT is done, what you're going to do is you are going to select all of the, um, the conversation starters and you're going to paste onto an Excel sheet. And I'm going to, I'm going to show you how I do it. So here is the Excel sheet and I'm going to type in here. I'm going to call it title, although it's not really a title. You can name anything, but um, it's where we are going to paste all of those conversations. And I'm going to just make this black. Okay, so I'm going to paste the uh, conversation starters here. And on the next column, I'm gonna type X, Y, Z company name.com. Let's pretend that this is your website. You can simply type once and then drag all the way. Perfect. From here, you are going to save onto your computer. The next step is you log in your Canva account. You do not need to pay for any of their subscription. You can do this using their free subscription. So you can type in here, Instagram, Instagram square. You can click using the blank one. And I'm going to create this in a very, very simple way because I don't need to go through designs, details and anything else. So I'm going straight to what the video is all about. You can, we, we can leave the design details to another video another day so today i'm going to show you what you can do so the next step is you're going to click here on the left you have apps and you're going to search bulk create i'm not going to search that because i used it recently to make another video so i have it already placed in here so bulk create and I'm going to upload that Excel sheet that we used a moment ago. Keep in mind that you must save that Excel sheet as CSV. So you click in, in here and you upload the Excel sheet. Once uploaded, you will see these two rectangles here, which these are the two columns that we put together. So before we work on this, I want to add something in here to show you that secret that I was telling you about. So it is a fact that uh, people will be more willing to interact with the post if they recognize the person that is posting. Here is the, uh, the trick. I'm going to use photos just to give you the idea. However, if you have your profile picture, you are going to use the upload button. You will, you will upload your profile picture onto into Canva and you're going to use that one. Let's see, I'm going to choose this one because I know that it does not have the background. I'm also going to add some text. I'm going to add a name. Here we go again. Joanna Smith is always in my videos. And I'm going to add a fake phone number and email at email.com. 
So again, I'm not going to worry too much about the design if the, the font is the best one. I just want to give you the idea to, to get this going. I'm not going to talk about designs details. So I'm also going to add something in here pretending that it is your logo. Let's pretend that this is your logo. So I'm going to just add in here the word logo just to give you an idea. Okay. Of course you would center this in a nice way. Perfect. Now I'm going to click in here and I'm going to add in here text and I'm going to place it in here. I'm going to give it, give some room. I'm going to center and I want to have this capitalized and I want this size 32. Perfect. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going back to the book create. We have the, uh, the details from the Excel sheet. So I'm going to right click on top of this text and I'm going to click connect data and click on title. And actually I forgot to add the company name. Let's pretend that this is not the, actually I can bring in here, bring in here, give some room. And I'm going to bring this to the left. Perfect. So let's go back to, sorry about that. So we are going back to the bulk create. I'm going to right click on top of the company name, go connect data, and I'm going to click on the information, in this case, the company um, name that I want Canva to apply to, to this um, field over here. So in here, you will we will have the conversation starter, and here we will have the company name Let's pretend that your company name is xyzcompanyname.com, which actually that's not a company name, that's really a website, but you get the idea. So I'm going to cl click on continue. And as you can see, Canva has selected all of the conversation starters. And just for this video, I'm going to unselect a lot of them. However, you can simply click on generate 30 pages and it will generate those 30. However, just for the video, I'm just going to select 10 of them to show you the idea. However, again, you can very easily generate those 30 at the same time. So those I want select are selected. I'm going to click on generate 10 pages. And here they are. I'm going to show you here, see the 10? Here they are. As you can see, it looks a little small for a, um, a Facebook post, but you can very easily make this as big as you can because you want to grab the attention. So you will have the question and you'll have your information here. And as you can see, it placed the company's name in there. See, it's in there. And in every single uh, post, you can see that it pasted all of the conversation starters. So from here, you can simply um, click on share, click on download. It will most likely assume PNG, but if for whatever reason you need to download as JPEG, you can go ahead and select that. Otherwise, you can um, go ahead and click on download, make sure that all of the pages are selected, download that onto your computer and you're ready to post. As you can see, very easily you can generate 30 posts in less than five minutes. 
it will take just a little bit to rearrange the, the size of the fonts, but it takes way less than if you had to create the entire 30 posts one at a time. So what you have left is really just to change some little details. If you would like 30 conversation starters every month, make sure that you use the link in the description box below and you will receive every month 30 conversation starters and you'll be able to use anytime, anywhere on your social media, wherever you would like. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you have any questions, leave those comments, um, leave those questions in the comments below and I will see you next time. Bye bye.